We're gonna learn the F chord now. F chord's got a new technique involved, and that is called something called a bar, and I'll explain that in a second, okay? So F chord can be a little bit tricky. Uh, probably a, a few days in, you're gonna to start to feel like it gets more comfortable because of the bar, okay? So I'm gonna explain what that is right now. So basically what a bar is, is anytime you put your finger over all, more than one string, that's technically called a bar. We're gonna have a, our first bar on this chord, Okay, basically you're gonna take your first finger and put it over the first two strings in the first fret and it co covers both strings. So the first thing I would recommend is just getting it good at, at sort of smashing your finger down and getting so you can hear both of those strings. Okay, that's the bar in the first fret on the first and second strings just using one finger. You're gonna use the bar in a lot of lot of types of music, but this is the first one we've learned, and it's in the F chord, okay? So, once you get good at this, again, there's a lot of pressure between my thumb and my first finger to, to hold down two strings, okay? Now, next finger is gonna be your second finger on the third string in the second fret. And you might find when you first start doing this that your chord sounds really plunky okay just start with this try to get a clear sound and give your cut self a couple of days until this one really sounds clean let's borrow the first two strings add your second finger to the uh, second fret of the third string now we're gonna have one more finger we're gonna add our third finger to the third fret on the fourth string and you play four strings so this version of an F chord you only play four strings now you can hear my, you can hear all the notes nice and clear on mine. Yours may sound like this. That's okay. It's normal. Okay. Again, as you get a little stronger and you swing this monkey out just a touch, swing your hand out just a touch. You'll find a good angle and you'll get stronger and you'll be able to actually have these chord, these all these notes sound clear. the F chord. Let's go over one more time. Okay, so the F chord's got uh, your first bar. You're going to put, put your first finger over the first uh, two strings in the first fret. Add your second finger to the third string in the second fret. And on the fourth string you're going to put your uh, third finger down on the fourth string in the third fret. And you play those four strings. Let's play it. Here we go. If your hand gets tired, it's totally natural. Just take your hand and shake it out. All right? That's the F chord.